According to one of Apple's main suppliers of the iPhone casings, will only one version of the iPhone be in complete glass next year. Uh, earlier rumors have said that all models, all versions of the iPhone next year will come in complete glass. But as I said, only one version will have complete glass on the back and front as the old iPhone 4S had. And if that's true, I personally think that model is the same model that will have an edge-to-edge -edge display because that would look really nice with glass on the back and an edge-to-edge -edge display on the front. That would be awesome. And personally, I have never cared about that glass phones will be easier scratched and crashed and so on because I'm so care full with my iPhones and other devices so I have never dropped a phone for example so uh, to me it doesn't matter that uh, the phone is in complete glass but uh, the only drawback for me is that uh, it will probably be a lot more heavy because of the glass. If you can remember the iPhone 4s and how heavy it was um, compared to the size of the phone this will be the same if you have an iPhone with a 5.5 inch display or a 5.8 inch display as the rumored iPhone Pro. If that is in complete glass you can think of how heavy that phone will be. But personally I'm not sure yet which uh, phone I will get next year of course but if I can choose I rather choose an uh, aluminium or steel phone. So I will choose an iPhone 8 in the same kind of material as uh, the iPhone 6s Plus that I record this video with over a glass phone. Yes I know a glass phone looks beautiful because I loved my iPhone 4s but uh, we will see. The weight of the phone is really important to me so I need to have as light device as possible. Okay, so next year's iPhone seems to be more interesting than this year's if the rumors are true. Okay, bye.